Hey guys, it's me, Jeremiah, and this will be a nail video, but like, there will be a lot of different parts. I know you can't see my face. Sorry. But, um, let's get right into it. This is how I do my nails before I go to the nail salon. Like, before I ever go to the nail salon, I've never been to a nail salon before. Um, so like, I'm gonna, t I'm gonna buff, I'm gonna buff off my cuticles with this bit. I'm using the nail drill from Melody Susie. I have a lot of professional stuff, not trying to brag. And put that on a really low setting. I'm actually using my other, my non-dominant hand. Well, I'm kind of dominant in both hands because of doing nails. There will be a bunch of parts of this video because nails do take a long time. There will be like one part preparation, preparation. The second part like poly gel. There will be like a different parts. Okay, so I'm gonna go into another bit that's for cuticles. It's another Melody Susie. Melody Susie? No, a Melody Susie one. Melody Susie. Um. Yeah, so, if you guys don't know, I do all my nails at home. Every time you see me with my nails, they're probably going to be done at home. If not, at a nail salon. So, like, we're going to buff off all this. It looks so weird the way I'm holding the nail drill. So, that's part of preparation. You really need to do that, and I'm going to do it like this also. To get rid of all my cuticle. And then I'm going to push up my cuticle with a... You call it? Not a cuticle pusher because those hurt me. So I use, like, the spatula of a poly gel brush. I'm just going to show you how I do that. A lot of poly gel residue gets on my skin, so I like to... Wipe that away with some acetone. Okay, there we go. Now I'm going to dust off my nails. There we go. That's what they're looking like. Cuticles looking a little dusty and crusty. That's because they aren't all the way, like, good looking. But now we're going to go in with sanding bit. Which, these ones, you literally have to put, like, the sander on. I like to put this one just a little bit up when I'm using my non-dominant hand. It's just easier that way. I can hold it more up. You want to buff your nails down. I'm sorry, I'm not putting it under the little camera. You guys are a little far away from me. I'm going to dust that off with my duster. Now I'm going to take dehydrator, nail dehydrator by Kiss. I know it's really cheap. Please don't give me shade. I know it's probably not good for my nails because makeup one thing I'll use with any type of makeup. I do care on my skin because I do a lot of skincare. My last skincare video, uh uh, I do a lot more now. Um, but like, I like, but when it comes to nails, I honestly don't give a crap. Now, since it is poly gel, you're gonna want to wear a base coat and put it under the lamp. And I'll actually point it at you when I'm doing the lamp prep step. I know it's really messy on my nail desk because I have, like, my nail stuff scattered everywhere. Okay, I'm going to take you guys to my lamp. Okay, there we go. That's my lamp. It's set on 30, and I just pop it in. That's actually my drill. It's all the stuff. There's a box full of crap. But 
don't want to show you because it's really messy over there. Okay, there we go. It's done. I'm gonna put this back down. Okay, so bye guys. Um, that was all the preparation that you need to do before your poly gel. Okay, bye.